Okay, so this morning we came ashore here looking for the post office since we need to ship back some parts that um, we got incorrectly for our dinghy motor lift. And um, so with that said, we are walking all over town because GPS doesn't seem to know where we are or what we're doing. And uh, we ran into a city worker who uh, gives out, excuse me, parking tickets, and she didn't know where it was either. Asked another gentleman, so he's sending us in a different direction. So we'll find out where we're going from here. So uh, Rick is behind me, and uh, we'll kind of go from there and see what we can see. But here's just a little look at what we're seeing in town. Kind of the main intersection or one of them here in town and we'll go up here a little bit and see what we can find. We have not explored the side of town you know because it's just off the marina and we always hit the local restaurants and brew pubs and shops there so we'll go down here and see what we can find and we'll give you more in a little bit. success. We have found the post office. After searching their post office for the things we need, we finally got it accomplished and we're back out in the fresh air. We're glad to be back out here in the fresh air and we'll just probably uh, check out the town a little bit before the rest of our compadres get here who are now en route from Foss Harbor to meet us over here in Paulsbo. One is under motor, one is under sail power. We'll see who gets here first if they take <laughs> the same route, which they may not, but we'll sure find out when they get here. Expected mid-afternoon, so we've got a little bit of time. What time is it? It is 11.10. Captain says 11.10. They're supposed to be here around 2.30ish, so we'll see. Um, we may just have a bite of lunch or something and uh, Possibly some libation. There's a brewery right here. Oh, dang, it's closed. <laughs> See? Priorities, people. Priorities. See some really neat, eclectic shops. We'll see if we can't find what's called Longship Marine. It was a... Um, consignment shop with all all things marine whether it's power sail whatever all things marine so we'll see if we can find it because it's moved it says we can find them here on the waterfront so we'll see if we can find them see if they're open for business yet. This is where they're going to be. Cool. How's it going? Good. Good. When's the projected opening day? Uh, for, uh, July 1st. All right. Cool. It'll be a nice facility for them. Oh yeah, that's yeah, awesome. Well. Awesome. Perfect. Thank you. Yeah, that'll be nice. Better parking. That'll kind of uh, give you a shot here. A little bit of the back side, a little bit of the front side, the marina side. And I'm going to put this away since I don't have a rain cover on it. And it's beginning to rain mist a little bit more. So one party down. Wrapped it up. One more party to go. 
Unfortunately, they're having a little bit of trouble with their um, sails, and then the motor died on them, wouldn't stay running. Got the sails figured out. Now uh, we haven't heard from them for a while, so we'll see uh, where they are and what they get figured out, and uh, hopefully see them before long. But we got two of us at this point. And we got both of the men doing duties. Rick in the aft lazarette. Carl was in his last, um, his aft swim platform. Now he's back up forward. You know, it's a race between forward and aft. Forward and aft. Got to get your steps in. Yeah. Right. Swing them arms, baby. Oh. <laughs> All right. So, just to look at today. Had another uh, fellow boater that we all know, Nick. He was uh, over here with us, but uh, one of the Navy Yacht Club guys uh, had a slip available, so he went over and he's over uh, in this harbor, over on one of the Navy docks uh, things. So we'll see how that all works out for him. But anyway, we're just uh, digging stuff out of our aft lazarette. We're gonna try to fire up our little generator and see how long it takes just to top off the batteries. Even though the solar's out, we're just not getting a lot since we don't have a lot of sun. But we'll go from there. More later. Good evening, folks. It is Friday evening in Liberty Bay, right outside Falls Bow. Class, overcast skies all day today and for the very first time we have our rafted up friends Chukamanji 2 I think is what it is I can never pronounce their name they pulled in an hour and a half ago and uh, got their new dinghy in the water they just picked up yesterday didn't have a chance to get it in and try it out. So I brought it up here and it's got a leaky seam. So they'll have to deal with that. It's another thing about boat life. And he's working on his motor, trying to get it to uh, to run. Not sure what the deal is. It's been a year, so I'm not sure what's going on with that. But working on it. Luckily, it's not raining and blowing to beat the band. It's a very light breeze and uh, it has quit misting rain and uh, we have a gazillion boats out here actually tomorrow is going to be a lot worse than today i'm thinking if anything was like uh, last year and we thought we would hook up the generator and see how that worked on uh, because it's just for backup, charge the batteries up. And so we've got that working. We got that working. And that is that is a pretty quiet little generator. 1600 watts with a 2000 watt peak. And it's been running for about an hour. And it's brought our batteries from 87% to 90 in an hour so not working all that great but in a pinch I guess it would do so with that we will say adios for the time being come back and see you later so this is what you do on a cold rainy day
reverse, Quinn. Should have. There you go. All right. Okay. What a beautiful day today is compared to yesterday. Give you a quick look. That was Quinn. You just saw off of uh, the new boat they just got, Jaman. Um, that name will get changed, but nonetheless, that's what they are right now. We're in the anchorage. I'll go forward and let you see what has come in. Give you a shot of what we have here. Several folks have rafted up in here. Get a group of seven sailboats back here that has rafted up. We got a group of three or four motor yachts. There's somewhere, oh, they're ahead of me. I'll turn around again. Off of my bow, of course, I can make a 360 degree turn to give you a shot of them. Those four rafted up. We got a couple power boaters, a couple sailboats, us, and uh, Jinkamungi here. We're all rafted up. We've been it holding good. It does not get any better than this compared to the yesterday we had. <laughs> And um, we are all just chilling. We got Rick and we got the patties who are rafted up next to us. We got tons of people rafting up, but it just doesn't get any better whatsoever than this. Go again! <laughs> What are you doing with a drunken sailor? What's a pirate's favorite letter? What do you do with a drunken sailor early in the morning? You'd say R, but no, it's the C. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Really? Really? You are gonna flip me off? <laughs> oh. I love you. I love you. That's what happens when it goes right. I got that on film now. <laughs> it goes right to your middle no, finger. Every time it goes straight to court. <laughs> Start that over. Start that song again. The morning is hell song. Yeah. Accidentally shaved too much. Kinda looks like you're a mauled by a bear. Actually, you bushwhacked your facial hair. Kinda looks like you were mauled by a bear. Now you're sporting a hybrid blend of chop goat tea. That's who you are now. <laughs> and that is by Mr. Carl no, Patty. No, that's by Taco Bell. When that is Mr. Bell, Carl Patty singing that. Bell. He's off of Jacob Munji too, and uh <clears throat> That was not from last night's libations. That's this no, morning's. No, that's, that's the lack of libations. <laughs> that's the lack of. That's what happens when my synapses are all touching at the same time. There you go. Thank you, sir. Okay, I guess I'll start over. Happy Memorial Day, everybody. Um, got our flag at half mass. We did all of that. Didn't have a recording. Here's Carl on our buddy boat this weekend. Good morning. We're getting ready to uh, untie him. He's going to go ahead and head out a couple minutes ahead of us yeah. while we get anchor up. But just a look at the bay this morning. Very calm. We're going to have everything against us and absolutely no wind today. But it's a nice day, so more later. And we cast it off our one buddy. They're getting everything ready. They're going to go out. We're going to 
finish getting ourselves ready here, get the anchor pulled up in a couple minutes, and then we'll all be joining them. So uh, we are off and running back to the home port. We'll see you later. All right, we are in uh, Rich Passage, getting out of Paulsbow this morning about an hour and a half ago at about 8 o'clock. And uh, it took us about 30 minutes to get the anchor up and clean. That, it's a very muddy bottom, great holding power, but it is um, really got to take a lot of water, buckets of water to clean that. I haven't got my uh, wash down pump installed. I uh, don't have all the parts and pieces to install that yet, so I still am using my bucket. But it's still, it's a nice day, a little hazy on the horizon, but uh, it's partly cloudy, well, partly sunny, mostly cloudy. We've already dodged a couple of uh, ferries. That's, uh, I don't know if you can see them off in the distance. That's uh, Chickamanji 2, Carl and Marsha, and Caleb. rowboat. Our good friends that uh, we went to that had so much trouble getting to Paul's Bow on Yaman stopped at the fuel dock to get uh, fill up fuel this morning and the starter burned out. So they are still in Paul's Bow. It's been a shakedown cruise of epic proportions for them. So we're wishing them well and hoping that everything uh, gets, uh, gets fixed. <laughs> so anyway, Seattle off in the distance over there. and the wind is uh, 7.2 so most of that self-generated obviously so gonna be another motoring trip you can barely see Mount Rainier underneath the clouds and right above the trees over off of Bashan Island that's behind Blake Island We are continuing our trip south. More in a bit. So here we are coming down to the end of Vashon Island. We just spotted a whale. Came up right between Jackamanji 2 and us. And uh, Judy was downstairs. I didn't have the camera going, so we didn't get a picture of it, Dad Gummit. I think it was a humpback, but I didn't get the fluke. All I got was a little fin uh, towards the tail. Okay, we 
we're about uh, 45 minutes out of port. See that in the distance. Traffic out here is getting a little bit uh, more. Not a lot, but a little bit. Over here on our port side, we got Jekamunji 2, who uh, rafted up to us all weekend. And they're uh, motoring in like we are. Not enough wind to sail. They can't, really. Uh, his roller furling is off. Uh, got his part finally delivered to him while we were gone, so he no doubt will get that back up and on. Then maybe we can go out and play and put some, uh, get some wind. Some of the lighter boats out here can do uh, sails, but we need more wind than what we have. But just wanted to give you a look at what we're seeing today. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up, make a comment down below, and subscribe. See you!